So tonight we're going to be talking about mirror ball motors. Why? Well, first of all, mirror balls are coming back in a big way. A lot of mobile DJs are using them. They're coming back in clubs and bars. It's a cool retro effect. And for those of you who haven't been DJing forever like I have, may not be familiar with mirror balls and kind of how they work. The first thing I wanted to talk about were the motors and the differences between them. Now the motor you're looking at right now is the M103HD. This is a 3 RPM motor, so it's spinning the ball around 3 times per minute. Listen very carefully. Virtually you can't hear a thing. These motors are incredibly quiet. Back in the old days, they made all kinds of noise. These, you can barely hear them, and they're a lot more robust. Now this motor is a little different. This is the kind of motor that I wish I had back in the day. This is an M101 HD. Everything I used to have was like a 3 RPM motor. This is a 1 RPM motor. And for some reason, the slower mirror balls are more dramatic. I think it's a really cool look. Both of these motors look identical, but they perform a little different. Again, the first one is a 3 RPM. And the second one is a 1 RPM. Which one's for you? That's up to you. But there's a little education on mirror ball motors for you. So stay tuned. I'm going to do some more videos on mirror balls. We're going to dive into some of the different fixtures you can use with mirror balls to create cool effects. Incidentally, this is an Icon Profile warm light I'm shining on this one. This would cover a huge area. And you could even put a gel on it if you wanted to, but we'll talk more about that in future videos. For now, I hope this helps somebody. Thanks for watching. Practice and enjoy.